Oh, I think we're about to play some Street Fighter 2. I know that sound. Oh, actually, no, we're playing another game I love. It's Disney's Aladdin. You guys see that lamp on the screen? One of my favorite Disney video games ever. You know who I am. It's your friend Arachnid Soul coming to you today, playing this game. It's a throwback game. And the reason I'm doing this is because not only do I love this game, not only did I love this game when I was a little kid, but also the guy who played the genie in this movie, in this franchise, Robin Williams, earlier this week, passed away. He took his own life. He committed suicide any way you want to put it. And I just remember so many awesome things. I remember being a little kid and watching Mork and Mindy reruns on Nick at Night. I remember the Aladdin movies. I remember watching Hook. I mean, the, you know, Mrs. Doubtfire, obviously. I, so many great movies. Dead Poet Society. Like, you know, the, the amazing body of work that Robin Williams had and the joy that he brought to so many people. And at the same time, I'm really disturbed that I hear some people now calling him a, a coward for committing suicide. You know, there's some people that just don't get it. A lot of the time when people commit suicide, it's because they're depressed. And, you know, you talk about people with mental handicaps and, and mental disabilities, and we just agree as a society, and rightfully so, that we don't mock them, we don't tease them, we don't make fun of them. But at the same time, so many people don't understand that depression is one of those mental issues. You know, I, I can't imagine somebody calling someone a coward for having uh, some other type of mental handicap. But let's briefly talk about this game. You're going to see the genie in a second. I had this game on Super Nintendo when I was a little kid. I loved this game so much. And here you're going to see genie come down. I loved this game so much. There's Robin Williams, my boy, my dude, that I actually went to Blockbuster Video, a place where kids, if you can imagine this, little kids watching this under the age of 12, you're going to think I'm making this up, but go find your older brothers and sisters Go find your parents, your grandfather, your grandmother, the next door neighbors who might be older and ask them. This was a building you went to to actually play games that you didn't have and get these things called VHS tapes and you put them in this thing called the v VCR. In any case, this is true. You'd give them money at the desk and they'd search around back there for about 10 hours. Sometimes they didn't have the thing. I went out to Blockbuster Video, rented this game on Sega Genesis, even though I had it on Super Nintendo, and actually rented a Sega Genesis because I did not own the console, purely so I could play a level on this game in the palace, I'm pretty sure, that doesn't exist on the Super Nintendo. That's a good game. And you guys will notice you don't see me playing that horrible Lion King game. Or the Jurassic Park game, which wasn't a Disney game, but we won't talk about that anyway. Boys and girls, ladies and gentlemen, what have you. It's been Arachnid Soul. It was a video that was kind of about Robin Williams, but actually was a lot about the Aladdin game somehow. I can't quite wrap my mind around the thought that there's some people who want to be there to emotionally support Robin's wife and his daughter, and they feel that the way to do so is by calling Robin Williams a coward. He's not a coward, he was an extremely funny man. It's unfortunate what happened to him, and you know, I wish his family the best. It's been your host, Arachnid Soul. Let me hear from you guys in the comment section. Later.